You there, adventurer! Ah, oh, my second favorite assistant. What a pleasant surprise. We may salvage this expedition yet. I'm afraid things are going very poorly inside this ruin. We suffered a major setback at the hands of Artisan Lenarman, a grave robber of exceptionally low breeding. He's looking for an artifact, you see, and thought he could use us to find it. I managed to escape, but left my Dwemer control rod behind. The heart of Lorcan, as if it even exists. The irony is that this ruin really does contain an item of power, a Dwemer relic called a Bathark Prism. If you help me rescue my aides, retrieve my rod, and obtain this prism, I'd happily compensate you. With the exception of capable bodyguards like Vimy Lacroix, finding competent assistance has proven difficult Unfortunately, she and I were separated during our escape. I suggest you begin searching for Vimy at our camp inside the ruins. That's an excellent question. Scholarship on the subject leaves much to be desired. One of my less daring contemporaries believes it might function as a kind of codex, translating tonal patterns into legible script. Difficult to say. A tonal codex sounds almost too good to be true. But I don't have the luxury of dismissing such rumors out of hand, particularly when a scoundrel like Lenarman takes interest. Because he's an incompetent fraud. The fool couldn't find dirt if he fell off a horse. He needs an experienced scholar to guide him through the ruin. You see, Lenarman believes this might be the final resting place of the heart of Lorcan. Not familiar with the myth? Priests will tell you that the god Lorcan tricked various divine forces into creating the world. This upset the natural order of things, and so his fellow gods yanked his heart out as punishment. Don't be ridiculous. The heart of Lorcan is a work of pure fantasy. Unless you believe it plausible that Auriel attached Lorcan's talking heart to an arrow and shot it across the sea, we'll find no ancient god hearts here. Sorry to disappoint. Yes, one of my own design. A fine piece of craftsmanship if I do say so myself. I hope those thugs didn't break it when they stole it from me. The rod exerts control over Dwemer Automata. Even a fool like Lenarman could cause some havoc with it. Yes, and I'm sure he's using it to great effect. The rod can deactivate some of the machines and turn others into allies. Far too powerful a device for the likes of Lenarman. When you face him, make sure you retrieve that rod. Easy huh? does it. You're safe now. Oh, thank the three Vimy got me out. Those mercenaries plan to... Uh, to use me as bait for those damned dwarven machines. Be careful in there, or you'll wind up with a shattered leg too. Well, if it isn't Narama's second favorite assistant. I'm assuming he told you to find me. As you can see, the situation's not ideal. We could use some help. Hmm. Naramo wants you to snatch his stupid control rod back from that oaf Lenarman, right? Well, we've got bigger problems. 
I rescued this lot from Lenarman's mercenaries, but they still have our dig leader, Kasuda, and two others. Well, if you're feeling spry, you could try to track down some information about this Bethark prism Naramo keeps yammering about. I was ready to cut and run, but with your help, we might still be able to turn a profit on this disaster. We're really doing this, huh? I hope Kasuto and the others appreciate the effort. Lotayil will get this lot back to the surface. Naramo and I will be right behind you. Oh, Vimi. I see you're still alive. Excellent. What are you doing in here? Didn't I just get you out? Saver, literally. Watch for steam vents up ahead. They always hiss before they fire. All right. Thank you. The Narman went deeper into the ruin. You can catch him if you hurry. <laughs> 